Hey everyone, in this video I will explain how to fix the surviving aftermath problem. Let's get started. The first thing that we need to do to run the Epic Game as administrator. So on your desktop, right click on Epic Games Launcher, then go to Properties. On the top, click on Compatibility and check this one. Run this program as administrator. Once you're done, just click on Apply and OK. And the next step after that, just go to search and type in their system configuration and open it up. And after that, on the top, click on services tab. And over here, look for Epic Online Services. Make sure it's checked. And after that, just click on apply and OK. And next solution, you need to uninstall or disable any third party antivirus on your computer, including Windows security. Then check for updates manually. And if there is any updates available, make sure to download and install them. Next, type in your search bar, graphics settings, and open it up. In here, we need to add aftermath application in the list. So to do that, just click on browse, open up your local disk drive, program files, and Epic Games folder. Select surviving aftermath. Click on aftermath 64 to add it. Once you add it, then click on option, and select high performance then click on save and the last step we need to allow aftermath and authorize epic account so to do that open up aftermath and click on play once you launch in the game you might get this notification so just click on allow and then the browser will automatically open up the epic games website next we need to click on allow to give permission to aftermath in case your browser didn't open up automatically, then you need to set up your browser as default. So to do that, just right click on Windows icon and open up settings. On the left side, click on apps. Then select default apps. In the search bar, type your browser name. So for example, mine is Chrome. And just click on Chrome. On the top, click on set default. And that's it, your browser now is set as default. So now, when you reopen the game, your browser will automatically open the Epic Games website. Then you can just allow permission to aftermath. Once you're done, restart your computer and try. If it's still no lock, go ahead with the next solution. The next solution is to uninstall and reinstall the aftermath. So to do that, just click on these three dots on the side in here. Then select uninstall. So once you uninstall it, try to reinstall it and after that, hopefully it should be working fine. And that's all. By the way, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please consider supporting me and subscribing for more videos. Thanks for watching.